Oh yeah, it's double. Double organic. Hey there, thanks for tuning in for another dose of vitamin D with me at Double Organic. Omega, omega sixes and threes. Essential fatty acids. Mmm. By now, by now we all know that, you know, too many omega sixes are bad. I'm just, I'm just gonna explain in simple ways why, why they're bad. They, they cause inflammation. So what do we need to do? Eat more omega threes, right? Because if we're eating this many sixes, we need to, you know, eat more threes. Well, not necessarily. We need to try and reduce the amount of sixes that we're eating. And, you know, a, a lot of things that are, are high in uh, omega sixes are a lot of the cooking oils and things that people eat. Uh, <laughs> you know, whether it's canola oil or safflower oil, all those oils that are put into uh, the processed junk you eat or, or that you're using it to cook with. Bad news. Don't do it. So we gotta reduce the sixes. Uh, a lot of animal products, darn it, also have a lot of omega sixes. But so do plant foods. So watch out. The next thing we wanna do is yes, eat things that have more omega threes. So reduce the six, increase the threes, right? We all know to do it, but we don't really do it. So excess omega sixes cause inflammation. How? I'm gonna explain how they can cause inflammation and pain. We don't want pain. Some omega six is good, don't get me wrong. Omega three fatty acids are converted into series three prostaglandins, which then signal other things to happen. The, the series three prostaglandins from omega three fatty acids they signal good things like anti-inflammatories in the body. They reduce inflammation. And they also uh, do vasodilation, which is to increase the diameter of your uh, blood vessels, you know, to reduce blood pressure. Good stuff, good stuff. A healthy amount of omega-6s go on to become series one prostaglandins. And just like series three, series one prostaglandins, they also do anti-inflammatory anti uh, pathways and, and things like that. But too much omega-6 spills over. We can't convert them to the series one prostaglandins fast enough. And so with too much omega-6 spilling over, they turn into series two prostaglandins. Those prostaglandins signal inflammation. Not good. Not good. And of course, as a reminder, what is high in omega-6? Animal products. Yeah. So vegans are in the clear. Wrong. No. Anyone can easily be consuming too much omega-6 and not enough omega-3s. So how does the series two, series two prostaglandin end up causing that inflammation and pain? Well, uh, Prostaglandin series two releases substance P, uh, you know, signals the re release of substance P, which then goes on to uh, go through a cascade and it increases inflammation. At the end of the cascade, it then uh, stimulates the increase of receptors for substance P. And then you get this feedback loop where too many omega-6s give you too many series two prostaglandins, which then has all these receptors for series, or sorry, for substance P, and just causing more inflammation, more pain. You think of substance P as being like substance pain. So the best thing to do is look at your diet, you know, see what you're eating, and reduce the uh, omega-6 fatty acids. They're really easy to overconsume. So, reduce your inflammation, stay pain free, eat a healthy balance of uh, omega 6 and 3 fatty acids. Some people would say um, a 4 to 1 ratio, some even as low as a 1 to 1 ratio. Uh, of, uh, you know, for every 
one, uh, omega three, yeah, four, omega sixes. The average, of, you know, American you've probably heard is like a, a, a one to twenty ratio, where it's one omega three for every twenty omega six. Crazy. So look into look into it and reduce them there. Omega sixes reduce inflammation, be pain free, and uh, yeah. Always be looking to reduce inflammation. All right, so look into your diet. And remember, get the six aspects of health every single day. Earth, air, fire, water, work, rest, earth, diet. Look into what you're eating, and how it's making you feel. See you next time. Let's walk the path of health together. Whoa, look at all those recipes. some of that oh yeah it's double organic I offer something I call double organic coaching I even offer it free to one person each month got lots of epic recipes and information on health and wellness to share with you connect on Facebook Instagram and of course YouTube